guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my Ipsy bag, and um, this is the bag for December, and um, yeah, I got it in the mail today, and I worked all day today, so I look disgusting, but I took my hair down, because so I went um, over to a friend's apartment, because they were having like a Christmas holiday party at their apartment, so that was fun. There was like a guy dressed, well, there was Santa. And there was uh, Rudolph and us, Frosty the Snowman, and you could take pictures. And it was there's food and kids, and it was a lot of fun. Um, I'm gonna put on my hat. I'm gonna put on my hat because my hair looks disgusting. So let's just uh, yeah, let's just uh, toss this bad boy on so no one can see how gross my hair looks. Um, so here's my empty bag. I do know um, a couple of the spoilers, but not too many. So um, I kind of peeked, but I didn't really. I was going to check my glam room, but then I'm like, no, don't do it. Your empty bag will be here in a day or two. So I, I avoided it. Okay, so the theme is celebration, and it says snap a pic of your glam bag and share it with hashtag Ipsy on Facebook or Instagram. Why? I don't know. Maybe there's a contest. Oh, yes. Win a one-year glam bag subscription, $110 value. So you take a picture and you post whatever. Anyway, you guys probably don't care. Or if you do care, you probably have Ipsy and already know about it. So um, some of the brands, also in case you're wondering, um, that we could possibly be getting or their deals on are right here. Again, they've gone the route with like not putting the actual like um, offers on here. So they're not really advertising them. You just now have to go on ipsy.com, which I guess is, it's a way to get people to go on ipsy.com and be more involved, but it, it's kind of nice to be able to tell you guys in videos right now, like, oh, 20% off this brand or whatever. Um, anyway, uh, wow, I really like this bag. This is probably my favorite bag they've sent. I really like this. This is, like, really nice. I'm actually really surprised. This is really nice. Um, it's black, and if you guys can see, it has this, like, uh, textured pattern that are, like, the little, they're, like, little squares, whatever. Um, it's glossy and kind of shiny, and I really like it. This has to be my favorite bag, only because it's, like, I feel like I could put my stuff in and, like, go out with this and, like, use, this is a really nice bag. Wow, Ipsy. I am pleasantly surprised. You saved the best bag for last. Okay, so I'm really excited about what I'm, oh, I'm really excited about what I'm getting. <laughs> oh my god okay so I saw some of the spoilers and I was like oh I hope I get that and I didn't want to know what some of the crappy things were that I you know didn't want really to look you know I not look forward to but whatever you know what I mean anyway okay let's just get into it um the first thing this is probably something I didn't want but whatever the first thing is a knickknack no not knickknack why did I say that Nika Nick Nika K Nika K New York I don't know whatever there's the brand right there. And it's clearly a nail polish. And it's in the color red. I'm glad I didn't get that weird color they were advertising, which was like gray, like slate color or something. It looked like mud. Um, it says lift here, so I, maybe I have to lift for the name. It's very strange that it didn't come in like a case, like a protective case in case it broke. Okay, yeah, there's nothing of interest underneath there. I... It just says NY139, so I'm sorry, I don't have, an, like, a color name, but if you can tell, it's red. So, not hard for, not hard for the eyes to see that it's red. Um, this is obviously a full size. This is a pretty big nail polish. I don't know if you guys want me to swatch this, but my nails are, like, disgusting. I literally, like, clipped them all and broke them all, and, um, okay, yeah, it's pigmented. It's nice. It's not like a sheer red. I just painted like a little chunk right there, but you can see. Um, yeah. Anyway, I don't want to spend too much time on that. I'm not even going to let it dry. I'm actually just going to wipe it off with a tissue. All right, the next product is a Pop Beauty eyeshadow trio. And this, ugh, they did a really good job. This is in Naturally Bare. So this is what it looks like. And um, let's see if I can angle this. So you can see it's in naturally bare and let's pop this baby open watch I'm not gonna be able to do this on camera okay you're not supposed to use your teeth 
but I might, oh, no, oh, I got it. Now that I clipped my nails, I like can't open anything. Like, how do people function without having some type of nail? I used to never have nails, and then I, you know, because I bit them, and then I had acrylics for the better half of like seven years. And then when I finally got my acrylics off, because I just didn't want to pay for them anymore and get them filled and like the maintenance, I hated it. Um, when I took them off, I never had the habit, like I dropped the habit of um, biting my nails. So if you're looking for a way to bite your nails, just get acrylics for years and years and years. Or just paint that like gross stuff that tastes gross on. Okay, so I finally got it open. But now I can't get this open. Okay, there we go. <gasps> Look at these colors. So this actually looks cream on camera, but it's not. It's like a shimmery light champagne color. The other two colors are coming off pretty well. Okay, time to swatch. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Mm. The first one, the champagne one was, ooh, was really good. It felt buttery. The middle one, not so much, but it has really good color payoff. And then the third one. Okay, I'll do it. These were um, one swatch, one swipe, whatever you would want to say. Light. I don't know how to, I don't know how to stop this light. There. Mm, there's like no light, what they look like. And then there's like terrible light. So very, very pretty colors. So this is like champagne, like I said. That's a warmer brown and then that's a cooler brown. Um, I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm really excited for this. This is like perfect to put in my purse. Really great colors. Really something that I would wear. I'm excited for that. Okay, let's move on because this video is already going to be too long. I always talk and talk and talk. Okay, I saw this and a lot of people don't like perfumes, but I really like these Demeter, um, scents because they're just really cool. Um, this one is Snow. And it's a perfume, rollerball perfume oil. I've gotten one of these before, and I got it in, I don't know. I, I, I don't remember what scent it was. But it was really, really nice. However, my mom likes perfumed oils. She likes body oils and stuff, so I gave it to her just because she really likes oils. But let me just kind of put this on my arm. So this scent, it doesn't smell like snow to me. It smells like springtime and grassy. So it doesn't really smell like snow. It's a very, very light scent that someone who has like a, a doesn't have a good tolerance for scents, they could probably still use this. Um, I really like these because they're oils and um, yeah. Mm. Mm. It smells good. It's a very, very, very light scent. So again, not something for someone who likes really strong scents. But good for someone who can't stand really strong scents. Anyway, next. Um, okay. I got a Be A Bombshell The One Stick in Girl Crush. And I love Be A Bombshell products. I've been very happy with the ones that we've gotten from... Actually, I've been really happy with like stuff we've gotten from Pop Beauty, Demeter, obviously, and um, Be A Bombshell. Um, yeah, okay, so I didn't know, Ugh, this is gigantic. Okay, so full size, probably not full size, but I don't really know what a full size would look like of that, and this is a full size trio, right? This is huge. So, um, this is Be A Bombshell, it just says the one stick, Girl Crush. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that this... If you can see, like, compared to my skin tone, what color this is, it's like a peachy coral. There's a lot of glitter to it. Um, if that helps, that's kind of, like, the color. I think this is, like, an all-over, like, all-around just color for a bunch of different things. Like cheek tint, blush. Kind of has a plas melted plastic smell. Um, that's what it looks like on my skin. So it's, like... Noticeable, but not noticeable. It has kind of like a very soft chapstick type consistency. Um, very blendable, like e like blendable, but like evenly blendable. I don't know how to explain it. Like it blended in and it wasn't like chunky where glitter chunks came somewhere and like didn't spread. It spread evenly. I don't really know how to say that. 
this very, very soft consistency. Like silk. Not like silk. Like powder. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not good at explaining things. But I really, really sheared it out. And um, it just kind of left like a glitter shimmer behind. Um, not my favorite. It's not something that I would buy. But it's like a full-size product. I don't want to wind this up to show you like how much I got because I'm afraid it's not going to wind back down. But I'm sure there's a lot in there because it feels pretty heavy and ginormous. Okay, next. Last thing that I got is the NYX lipstick. And this is in LSS565 B2. Whatever. This is one of their round lipsticks. Oh, there we go. 565. And this is the color. It's kind of like a dark, mauve nude color. Whoa, it's dark. And that is it. I don't know that this is a color I would use. And there it is right there. It might be. All right. Let's try it on. This isn't going to be good because I'm doing this like in my viewfinder. Uh, you probably need a liner with this. Okay. That's what it looks like. It looks more red on me, like a burnt red, brownie red. I don't know if it's my Clinics that has this consistency, like chunky consistency, or the lipstick. Anyway, the round lipsticks are not my favorite. Um, I don't really like the formula. Some of the formula, some of them have really great formula. Some of them have a terrible formula. So this is one I'd have to like try for a while to see if I like the formula. But sorry, I don't want to be like all up close and disgusting in your faces. But uh, from what I see in the viewfinder, it looks like it applied pretty evenly, which is good. Um, yeah, good for the holidays. And I mean, these are like, I don't know, whatever, $4.99, something like that. Anyway, I'm super happy with this bag. Um, love, love, love this bag. Forgot to show you the inside. It's like this deep red color. Oh, my God, I love it. I think this bag is probably my favorite part of everything that I got. And then I would have to say the eyeshadow, the eyeshadow trio. I forgot to show you guys that it came with a little brush as well, um, which I probably won't use. But um, got the bag, got the eyeshadow trio. Demeter Snow Roll-On Full-Size Nail Polish. Not really crazy about nail polish, but whatever. Um, lipstick and the um, all-around color stick thing thingy. So, great for Ipsy. Um, I've had, uh, I've been subscribed to Ipsy since March. Been super happy with it. Um, it's $10 a month. I'll leave a link below. That's like my referral link. You, you gain me points if you sign up under my referral link. Um to get like trade them in for free products or whatever and then if you review products you get points as well anyway uh that's it so thanks for watching guys i'll see you in my next video let me know if you're subscribed to ipsy what you guys got if you guys got something different than me if you know more about this like stick thing uh let me know what color lipstick you got or whatever um otherwise i'll see you in my next video bye guys